if someone loves you, so someone, they, they'll tell themselves, like, if this person really loves me, then they will change for me. So they'll tell themselves that, you know, even though, once again, we may not be compatible, we may have a lot of issues, a lot of differences, but we love each other. And inshallah ta'ala, we'll, we'll make it work. And I know, like, there's things I don't like about her, but I will change her, inshallah. And out of her love for me, she will change. Or she may be telling herself, out of his love for me, it will change. And as they say, love conquers all, right? Have you guys heard that? Love conquers. So they say, you know what? We'll get through all of this because of our love. And subhanAllah, this is this, once again one of, one of the main issues that I've seen is that when people get over that infatuation stage, they realize that it's very, very hard to change someone else. And it's really that person who ha has to want to change themselves. And once you're no longer infatuated with the person and it's no longer, you're past that honeymoon stage or whatever they call it, five, six months, four months, two months, depending on who you ask, right? Once you're past that stage, it's very difficult. So I always tell young couples, I say, listen, this person, the way they are in front of you right now, the way you see them, marry them, keeping in mind or, or telling yourself that they're never going to change. And if you're happy with them the way they are right now, then go ahead and get married. But don't make the assumption or don't assume that they're going to change. Or don't tell yourself that, yes, one day this person will change.